Hi everybody, welcome to the Colors of Beauty by Elle. I'm Isabel. Today we're gonna, I'm gonna be showing you how to get these fabulous eyebrows. I just love them so much. You can sport them anywhere you go. And you know, I, I love to dance. So, you know, you can wear this like to the club or anything. You can just like fabulously just comb them. And um, you can even do a comb over on there. Like if you your ears get cold, you know, you can be like, and so anyways, let's, hey, go on. You're just jealous. I'm fine, I'm leaving. Jealous? You're jealous? Go away, go comb yourself somewhere. Look at that, you're leaving, you're leaving hair everywhere. <sighs> I'm sorry, you guys. Got interrupted by that. Oh. Anyways, welcome to the Colors of Beauty by Elle. I'm Isabel. I don't know who that was. I'm sorry. Anyway, today I'm gonna show you guys how I do my eyebrows. I've had some people um, request to see how I do it, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you. And without further ado, here we go. Okay, so let's get started. The first thing um, that I do when I do my eyebrows is I go ahead and comb them. Now I don't have a lot of eyebrows to begin with, you know, like they're not real like um, thick. I wish they were a little bit thicker, but they're not. So for you, those of you who have really nice uh, thicker eyebrows, what you wanna do is just comb your eyebrows first and then lay them flat. Move that hair out of my way here. And then comb. Okay, and what that does, it has, it lays your eyebrows down. It gives you the basic shape of your eyebrows. Um, eyebrows are important because they shape your face. Um, you know, first of all, what I do is I get um, a brush like this. This is. One that I just got from the drugstore. I don't even know what it's called. I think Mir Mirad or something like that. Um, it's got like an angle tip this way and it's thin. Okay. And then it's got a comb on this side and then a little brush. Um, so then what I do is I get um, eyeshadow. This I've had for a long time and I'm so sorry it's kind of nasty doodle. But I've had it a long time and it, it works for me. This is called Bark and this is from L'Oreal. So what I do first is I get the shadow on this little, um, on the slanted brush here. And then I go ahead and then I um, outline my, my eyebrows. So this is what I do. I'll outline here. That. And then I'll start from the bottom. And you don't want to go too far in this way because then because there's you, you'll see in a little bit. I'll show you in a little bit why. Um, and then you kind of want to just go up. And I always touch right here, and then I go down. Okay. And then I do the same thing on for the uh, for the top portion. I don't go too far in. Um, you always want to leave a little bit of space right here. Um, so then I start from the top here, and then go up. And then again down. Okay, that gives you a basic shape of how your eyebrow is going to be. Now you can shape your eyebrow however you want. You know, um, just follow the brow, the brow line, um, and then your your brow bone. So it, let's do that again. And then what I do is, then I just start to fill in, like little strokes. And then again, don't go too far this way. Um, so I'll show you in a second. And then just, you know, there, just like that. And the nice thing about that, you can always like rub, you know, rub it off on top there if you make a mistake. It's 
only makeup, okay? So don't, don't worry about it, you know? Okay, so the reason why I didn't want you to go in this way too far, because I, I always like to leave this right here um, a little bit lighter than the rest of my eye. So what I do is I get a, a clean X and then I just, or a rag or whatever, and then I clean this off a little bit. So there's no, um, there's no shadow on it. And then I just like go back and forth and comb it towards, there we go, towards the, the outer. See how it's lighter? And then if you wanna shape it a little bit more, what you could do is you could always like get a little bit on your brush, a little bit more eyeshadow and go at the beginning, you can just shape it like this and like that. And that'll give you, you know, that squared off look. And then what I like to do, because my um, my hair is darker, I get this other eyeshadow. Um, this is from Studio Gear. This one's also called Bark, but for some reason it's a little darker, you know, because formulas are different. So it's a little bit darker. Um, than the other one. So what I do is I get a little bit on there and then I start to um, make this just stroke it lightly at first so that there's not a lot of product going on the eyebrow at one time and then I go and then I go over that lighter eyebrow color to make it darker towards the end, towards the tail. Just like that, okay? And then just wipe off this, and then just bring it in softer. So there you go, okay? Um, the next, Okay, so the rule of thumb with eyebrows is they say that you're supposed to um, go from the, ed from the nose to just straight up and that's where your eyebrow starts okay or and also where it's supposed to end is from the nostril to the eye like this and that's where it's supposed to end and then to find your arch of your eyebrow go from the from your nose to the center of the pupil and that should be the highest point of your eyebrow just like that okay now what what I like to do um, after after I do that, I to get give it to clean it up a little bit. I like to use a concealer. This is my favorite concealer to use for that. This is the Hard Candy Pencil Concealer in Medium. Is I just outline it again. I go like this and up. Okay, and then just like that. Like you're tracing it around the eye and don't worry about it if you if it looks a little messy at first because then I get a concealer brush this one's from Sigma and um, I just blend it out and then that way you have a cleaner eyebrow just like that so I, I, I like to do this and it also highlights the top of your brows too because you want a little, you want this part of your eye, of your face to be highlighted. Okay, like a heart. Okay, this part of your face should be highlighted here um, and because it gives it more, um, it just brings it out more. So there you go. Just like that, okay? And then afterwards, of course, I gotta have my ABC gum. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, you. I always get uh, one uh, eyeshadow that is two shades lighter than my than my uh, natural color of my face. I just put it under here, just like that. Okay, so it's really really easy. Now, sometimes I use 
the Anastasia, is, this, is it how to say it? Anastasia? Pencil um, for my brows. I'm gonna do it on this side too so I can show you. Um, and this is a really nice one. Um, it has, it's double-ended, so here it's got the, the product on this side. You can see that. And then on this side, it's got a little brush, a little spoolie, which is it's so nice because then you can much do the same thing on this side, but with the pencil. So I start from the bottom, and then I just use uh, short strokes. Just like that. And then I go to the top, leaving this part again. You want to leave that part a little bit. Um, you don't want to go in too far when you're putting this on. Well, I, I don't do it anyways. Okay, so you want to outline your eye like that and then you start to color it in. Again, leaving this part right here um, lighter. Now you're gonna see a lot of little bald spots in here and that's okay. Because we're gonna fix that in a second. Okay, what I like to do is get this end of it and then brush. Oops. If you wanna bring that product down and straight cross. Okay, you get, you get the hang of it, right? Okay, so then for this side here, for the inside, I go back and then I just flick it up or towards the, the outer edge of the outer portion of the eyebrow. Okay, now if you, um, want to go back and make it darker you can do that with your you know with you can go back and then darken up some more spots if you want to okay okay so there's two different looks well I, I don't know if it's two different looks but just two different ways of you can do you can do your eyebrows if you want to go ahead and, and do this side darker with your pencil you can just put some more in there um, so, but that's up to you what, you, what you want to do. And then I go back with my hard candy concealer. And again, trace it. And then go back with my concealer brush. Okay. And then you go, and then, so then I just go ahead and, um, put my eyeshadow under here again. Okay. So there you are, that's how I do my um, my eyebrows. Not like, what's her face? Yeah, that wasn't very pretty, was it? <laughs> okay, you guys. Um, all right, now, also I did wanna mention that if you wanna do it a little, you know, like you could do it lighter too. Um, you know, if you wanna go out during the daytime, um, you need to just intensify the color or uh, make it lighter, whatever pleases you, you know. Um, you do wanna, you really wanna stay away from McDonald arches, you know, I call them McDonald arches, the ones that just go like Because there's a lot of um, stencils out there. Now, Anastasia makes uh, really nice stencils for your eyebrows. If those of you who, who don't have eyebrows or have real sparse eyebrows or really light eyebrows, and um, you don't know what shape you want. She's, uh, they have um, really nice stencils that you can use for that. Um, and uh, that's it for today. And thanks for watching, you guys. I'm glad you tuned in. And remember, subscribe and rate. Ding! Bye, mi amorcito. Goodbye. Yeah. Ciao. Ciao.